Okay, so we've got these two forces, P and Q, acting on the particle for question six, and we're given two pieces of information. So the first of them is that the magnitude is root 40. So that means if I go P along and Q up, the magnitude or the length is 40. So that's a Pythagoras thing. Um, the second bit of information is that the um, angle to the horizontal, so that's that one, is 30 degrees. Now this is the opposite and this is the adjacent. So tan of 30 is opposite divided by adjacent. Now tan of 30 is 1 over root 3, I believe. So Cross multiplying here, I get root 3q. You can't see, sorry. Uh, root 3q equals p. And now I just have some kind of horrible simultaneous equations. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to substitute what p is worth into p for that one. So squaring it. I'd get 3q squared plus q squared equals 40. So that's 4q squared is 40. So q squared is 10. So q is the square root of 10. And then I need to get substitute back in to get what p is. So p is root 3 times q. So root 3 times root 10 or root 30. And they're both forces, so they're both in Newtons.